is Carly and this is my third instructional video for my McCollum College math class. Today we're going to identify the open interval on which the function increases or in decreases. The function is the 2x cubed minus 9x squared plus 1. First you'd have to take the derivative, so 3 times x squared minus not do 2 times 9x plus 0. So it would equal 6x squared minus 18x. Okay, so then you want to factor that out. So it would equal 6x, x minus 3. Then you want to find out when the derivative of the function equals 0 or when the derivative of the function does not exist. It's a polynomial, so it exists everywhere. So we want to find when it's zero. So it will equal zero when this x is zero or when x is three. Okay. So you start your number line over here. Okay. And then you use your function to six x and the x minus three. And then you want to pick a number after this interview, interval, so an easy one would be negative 1. So 6 times negative 1 would be a negative number. Then negative 1 minus 3 would also give you a negative number. Then you can just pick an easy one like 1. And so 6 times 1 would give you a positive number. Then 1 minus 3 would still equal a negative number. Then we can pick 4 here, so 6 times 4 is a positive. And then 4 minus 3 is a positive. Okay. Okay, so you times these together to find whether it's increasing or decreasing. So negative times a negative is a positive. Positive times a negative is a negative. And a positive times a positive is a positive. So the f function would be increasing, then decreasing, then increasing. So the function is increasing. from negative infinity to zero and three to infinity. And it's decreasing from zero to three. And those are your intervals.